it moved directly into the heart of the Little Rock metro area, causing widespread destruction across neighborhoods, schools, and businesses. Power lines snapped, vehicles were tossed, and countless homes were reduced to rubble. Emergency managers declared a mass casualty incident as first responders began searching through the wreckage. The National Weather Service office in Little Rock issued a rare tornado emergency for parts of the metro area, underscoring the life-threatening nature of the storm. Tornado emergencies are only issued when a large violent tornado is confirmed to be impacting a densely populated area. That warning would be one of more than 20 issued across the state of Arkansas alone over the course of the afternoon and evening. Supercells were tracking northeast at over 50 miles per hour, giving residents very little time to react. As the sun began to set, tornado activity showed no signs of slowing down. Multiple long-track tornadoes were simultaneously active in Iowa, Illinois, and Tennessee.